Thank you for joining this quick Getting Started screencast for Einstein email recommendations in Marketing Cloud, brought to you by Salesforce Support. To see more content like this, hit subscribe. In this video, we will learn how to implement Einstein email recommendation using the setup wizard. Einstein email recommendation helps you make great recommendation content available via email to your users. Let's set up Einstein email recommendations since it's our first time using it. First, navigate to Email Recommendations under Einstein. From here, click OK, let's begin. You will be redirected to the Options and Configuration page. You will need to select the catalog type you would like to work with. If you're not sure yet, you can select both. In this video, we will import a product catalog. Let's click on Product and Content. Click Next. We are now on the Attributes section. On this page, you will need to select the attributes that you want to track. Let's select them all for both catalog types, product and content. Click Next. On this new section called Users, you are being asked to select the user attributes for tracking. Link website behavior and email identity is selected by default. This will enable you to track user information. For our implementation, let's select Custom User Profile Attribute. You can then add custom attribute descriptions such as name, gender, and age. This will enable you to create rules to modify the recommendation. We will leave it empty for the time being. Let's click on Localization Support to provide recommendations in multiple languages. Click Next. On this activity page, you are being asked to select the activity you would like to be tracked. By default, user activities are collected. Category View, Insight Search, Cart Activity, as well as Purchase Activity are selected by default. If you want one of these behaviors to not be tracked, you can deselect it. We will leave this page with all behaviors selected. Let's click Next. Here is a summary of all sections we reviewed. Let's have a quick look to make sure everything is correct. Click on Finish. A pop-up will appear if you want to send instructions regarding the implementation. We will skip this step. We are now on step number two. We can see on the user interface the number of attributes, as well as the metrics we selected previously. To continue, we will need to import a catalog and to install the collect code on our website to finish the implementation of Einstein email recommendation. Let's click on Integration Instructions. On this page, you will see Collect Code Snippets to add to your website to track behaviors. Let's have a quick look. Click on Back to Main Menu. We are now going to import our catalog. Let's click on Status. We can see a warning saying that the catalog is not yet imported. Let's click on Admin to fix this warning message. Then Catalogs. As no catalogs were previously imported, let's click on Connect a New Catalog. Let's select Product as this is the type of recommendation we want to make. You have three options to import your catalog. FTP if your catalog file is already on your FTP. Public URL if your file can be reached via a public URL or Manual Upload if the file is on your desktop. Let's select Manual Upload and select the file from the desktop. In Section 3, you will need to select the delimiter used inside your file. In this example, I'm using commas. Let's select Comma Delimited. In Section 4, you will need to select the unique ID from your file and add it to the text box. 
In my case, I'm using a column called unique underscore ID as my unique ID. In section 5, you will need to select whether this is a partial catalog or not, which means is the file you are importing going to overwrite the existing catalog or not? I will select false as this is the very first import I'm doing. Let's now click on Upload New File. You will be redirected to the catalog's main screen. The process can take some time to successfully import the file inside your catalog. Click on Map Your Fields. On this page, you will need to map the columns from your file with the columns from the catalog. Let's map them now. In the Additional Fields section, you can select Tag Fields, which will enable you to use User Data Scenarios. Let's select a few fields. Click Save. Let's wait a few seconds for the file to be fully imported in the catalog. Now that our file is fully imported, let's click on Overview. We will need to install the collect code on our website. Let's click on Integration Instructions to select the code we will have to implement. You will need to install the collect code on your website following the instruction on the screen. Once this is done, click Back to Main Menu. The implementation of Einstein email recommendation is now finished. Click Get Started to start creating your first recommendation. For more information, check out help.salesforce.com or join us on the trail at trailblazer.salesforce.com.